So this is Vera Miller. She, I understand, Vera, you were one of the first students at uh, at the school, right? The first kindergarten. I was the first kindergarten. Okay. And one and only at for for a while, yes, because I must have won the kindergarten a couple of years ago because it seemed like I was I don't know I was too young to be in there, but if you took me. They took me because to, to help my mother out. Okay. So what was it like walk, taking the walk and and and? Uh... Oh, it was nice. We, we were to, we had a half a block down to a corner. Then we had a, a from Grant Street Street over to Industrial was two blocks and then two blocks down and the, well, so it was about six block. Okay, like that's that. not too bad. Yeah, yeah. It was, they're all temporary buildings, as I said, they're wooden buildings. You walked up the steps, uh, yeah, and it held about, I'd say, about 30 children. And, uh, and down below, up the steps, there's to a porch, and then up the, up the porch, up to, up go upstairs. And there, and I said, like I said, I guess it held about 30 children. And uh, then you had, <laughs> this was an interesting thing. You had to go to the, the bathroom or downstairs and, and the basement. So when you had to go to the bathroom, you had to go down outside, come down the step, outside, walk down the side of the building, and then walk down the basement. And you were, if you were a little like me, you were always afraid. <laughs> and so when you when you'd go down the basement, you would you peek down to see if anybody was down there. Then you would go down the steps, and then you still had to go inside again. And you would stand there and you looked like to see if if anybody's feet were in the in the in the to toilet. You know? mm -hmm. And. Uh, or in the rooms, there were other side rooms and whatnot. And it, it was interesting it was, <laughs> and it was scary, and, but nobody ever bothered us. Okay. Mm. And, and you stayed in the school from kindergarten all the way through to? Eight, through, the, through the eighth grade. Eighth grade, grade. wow. Mm -hmm. So what would you say that experience was like? How would you describe that whole experience? Oh, I am. Uh, did you enjoy it? I, yes, I did. I did. We, uh, I especially, I guess when, when, when I'm think, I think about when I was small uh, in the kindergarten or in the first few grades, it was really interesting to us. They, they, we, they, we walked in a schoolroom, there was a big, a long sandbox. Uh, a sandbox maybe for somebody in this age don't know what sandbox is, but it's, it was a box you could, uh, like a table, but it was an indent, indent. And then there was a lot of sand in there, and there were, we had chairs around there. And uh, the teacher would could, uh, t tell stories about, let's say, uh, I, oh, I remember especially that, um, What is it called? Uh, burning uh, lots. Remember this? Uh, we reverse. Remember lots. Why? Mm -hmm. We always remember. We we're told that that was one of our main memory verses. But uh, they, uh, the Lord had told them to get out of the city, but they didn't want to. And then, so finally, when some of them some um, lot and his wife and went and some of the children uh, older children and um, you, you could the teacher had uh, somehow another at a little on one end of the sandbox was this little city set up and and uh, I guess Why? now that I think of it, it was Why? probably it was Why? it was a it was paper it made out of little things were made out of paper and then the little hill, uh, you can walk up, they see Lot and have a 
than them walking up the hill. I don't know where now. I think it was probably stick people or something like that. <laughs> and and uh, they walk up, they walked, had them walk up the hill. And then all of a sudden, and I don't know how the teacher did this. And now that I think of it again, probably had probably had a, 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 a match or something, a cigarette lighter. And, but we didn't know it. And all of a sudden, uh, Lot's wife was, didn't want to go, you know, she didn't want to go out, didn't want to leave her, leave her children and whatnot. And uh, she, she looked back and the city was burning. And I saw, I guess the teacher without us, he was talking sore and, and told, we were so excited to remember this, to, uh, to hear the story. You know, and I want to say that uh, we didn't notice that he had, that wow, well, whatever way uh, he, he, let he the started burning, and that little tent city was burning, and uh, and then somehow or another there was a little lady, uh, something resembling a lady, I guess, and she went and then. She, we were so excited looking at the city burning. We looked up, and here was this little person, all white with salt. Salt, mm -hmm. remember that? You know. Wow. And it was, it was, it was interesting. Yeah. For a long time, I didn't understand how, <laughs> how that was done. Yeah. Do you remember your teacher's name? This teacher. Well, I don't know. That wasn't Brother Salter. Brother Salter was our first teacher. Mm -hmm. This was one lady, probably Sister Cunningham. She was the second teacher mm -hmm. there. But, uh, yeah, right in there. And it, was, it was interesting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, we had, uh, oh, I don't know. Uh, oh, the Parkland School was, a, was about a half a block away from us. Just a, maybe not that the big, big school. And uh, they would always tease us because we had a, we were in this building, this temporary building, and a wooden building, white, uh, white wooden building. And uh, in the winter time, or, or any time really, we were in school, they would to get out earlier, they would come through, it was instead of going straight down this, uh, Street and then m making the curve, they would come through the, through the, uh, well, the parking lot. We used the parking lot for a playground, and uh, they would call out. Uh, they would say we had a, a cow bell. If the if the teacher here would hear a with uh, like recess or something, she'd ring the bell and it was a cow. I guess it was a cow bell. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and, and they would laugh at us and, you know, make fun of us. And, uh, we didn't care. And, um, so, uh, one day uh, in, in the winter time, she let us out of school early. And uh, this was Brother Salter, this was another teacher uh, later on, let us out of school and told us to make this fence out of uh, snow. And really, we just made God and God just snowballed. <laughs> And when they came, came through Holland, and they thought we were up in the school, and they were all laughing and howling and making fun of us, and when that, and we belted them with snowballs. We never had any trouble. <laughs> <laughs> we were they they couldn't see us behind this fort, mm -hmm. you know, it was so slow. and we never had any trouble out of them anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, what was your favorite class? My favorite class. Let me see. I don't know, I don't know that I had any favorite class. I, I, I like two people. Okay. Mm -hmm. what, what was interesting about it, uh, we had a teacher, and uh, this is the first year, uh, we had a teacher named Brother Salter. H.T. Salter, Salter Henry. Henry something Salter. And, uh, he, I was sitting, I was in, in the first row uh, because I was, you know, the lowest, 
when they we sat by Rose, uh, and he um, he would tell us not to talk. He would sit up in front in the class. And he would, but he he had a class up front, and he was working on the board with them and looking. He would just uh, to turn his back to the rest of the school, and those classes he was work, working with, and. Um, He said, don't talk. So I didn't talk as long as he was facing us. But when he wasn't facing us, he would turn his back. And he would be in his chair. The chair would you know, lean back. He would lean back. And I, Pauline was my favorite. Uh, Friend? No, she was my sister. She okay. was the next oldest from me. Um, Pauline, yeah, then I was the next two, three years older than I was. And she would let uh, and I would talk to her. I just whisper thanks to her. She was in the next row for me. And he would say, Dear, did I say don't talk? And I didn't understand how he knew I was talking. And I was growing until I found out how he knew. He would put his glasses, and I went to a camp meeting when I was growing out in Central States, I think it was. So one of the camp meetings, anyway, another conference. Uh, Lottie was living out there, and I went to visit them in, during camp meeting. And um, I said, Brother Salter, how did you know? I said, you, you're backwards to me. And he said, he, he wore glasses, and he was looking at the board, I thought. But he said he would always push his glasses away from his little, little boy, from his, uh, from his, face. You know, his yeah. eyes, yeah. and uh, it was like a mirror. Mm -hmm. You could see, and he would he would see. And he said, he said, I would always, I would always be disobedient. And he, he, so he, that was the days when they could, yeah, so I don't like to use the word quit to me. The strap was spanked, spanked so, yeah. So, yeah. so you got spanked? Oh, I got spanked. <laughs> I get too many, too many, too many, some spanking, yeah. 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 And I, and it's, it was really funny because I thought, well, he's not going to spank me because Mama's here. And that's another thing, too. Those were the days when the parents would come to the school, and they would come up and they would visit the school. And they were encouraged to visit the school. So after Mama had a uh, uh, Lottie, she would take the buggy, put her in the buggy, Lottie and, and roll her, roll her, and she'd come up to us and sit for a while, you know, and listen to the classes and what not. And other parents did too, if it wasn't, you know, too many at one time. And, uh, so I thought, you know, he's not going to put me in. <laughs> he's not going to spank me. And Mama's sitting here. That didn't make any difference. I couldn't understand how she would let him mm -hmm. let him spank, give me two little spankings. <laughs> but it was, it was interesting. <laughs> you know, didn't. You cry, but you know, you didn't hear. Yeah. yeah. There was one thing you, you had. You were close to you, to the other students. You, know, you had friends. You had, you know, a, the public school I went to was a big school, high school. I had a, a town called Mount Marsh right out of Flint. There was, there was there were a lot of, we had to ride the bus. And there, there were a lot of kids and whatnot. And, and, uh, oh, it was, it was different, altogether different. Yeah. 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 Uh, you know, it, I, I enjoyed it, but I naturally, the church group was the best. Mm -hmm. When we had, cause we had uh, programs, we gave programs uh, in church school. We had programs from the uh, neighborhood and the people, church the people, would come and listen to us recite poems and whatnot. And we had, we, like I said, we had, the church was on the the basement, the basement, and then you walk up about seven, let's say five steps, 
and you were in a, the ch church, and then you walk up about maybe 20 steps and you're in the school. Well, in the, in the, in the, the windows were around, and you, and you always open the windows. Um, by the time we had a, by the time we had school closed programs, we would have to open the door, and open the door and open the windows. And then with the people in the neighborhood would come and stand outside on the porch. And we invited, we invited them to. And we'd hear us say our, our poem, to hear us sing and do a little, uh, what is this? There was one thing we called, uh, i trying to think of what it was. We had wand drill. Okay. Have you heard of that? It's 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 a you you had a stick. It's like you you had it was a broomstick really. The parents would save the brooms and they save the brooms and we would we would recite things together, and sing together, and 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 make motions together with those brooms. It was it was really interesting. Mm -hmm. And uh, the neighborhood would porch. The porch of the, of the church would always be full. They would stand outside and they would look in the, in the windows. They could come in if they wanted to, but when they saw us coming there at night, you know, they knew it was going to be in the springtime. We were going to have some kind of program and they'd list. They were anxious to hear. Yeah, yeah. Did you ever find out how much it cost to go there? Or, or? You know, I, I wondered. I, I don't know. I think. When I think about it, I think the church paid for that. I don't think we paid for that. In later years, yeah, but, but, but in the earlier years, I don't think we paid for that. I think the church paid the expense of that. Yeah. I could be wrong. But I... So are you happy your parents sent you? Pardon? Are you happy your parents sent you? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. I, I... I learned a lot in church school, yeah. And we were always so good. Church school was like, like a family. And we were always so close. I was thinking, um, it felt so bad, you know, because we were, we, church school was a family. It was a family. We were all family. We had picnics together. We ate together. We did everything. As a matter of fact, the, the teacher uh, organized one time, we had hot lunches. Wow. Two ladies each day cooked together. My mother and uh, another lady, and then uh, Sister Miller, as a matter of uh, I married her son. They cooked together. And so these two ladies were sisters. They cooked together like that. And they mon Mondays, Tuesday, you know, to Friday. And it was interesting. They they cooked. And we were, we were talking not too long ago. What we remember the hot lunches we had, you know, and. It was just nice. And so, as I was saying about this fellow, it was just like my brother joining again, you know. It was, it was, it was, it's, there, there's a bond, there was a bond there. When we had picnics together, we had parties together, we had, we were just close. We were just close. Mm -hmm. We were a family, like that's what I, we used to say, we were.